Hey everybody. So today I want to show you how to um, change the DPI of an image using an um, application called GIMP. Now GIMP is basically a photo editing software that you could get free um, online and it's very, very similar to um, Photoshop. Okay, so this is the image that I have here on screen that I want to adjust the um, DPI. So we're going to use this image um, to do this particular project. So let me just minimize my screen a bit. Okay, so this is the app application here, GIMP, right? Um, you could see the website address, GIMP.org. You could, you could go, on, go online and go to the website and you could download it free of charge, right? And just download the app and it's on your desktop. You could use it, right? And so what we're going to do next, uh, like I said, I'm going to, I already have it on my um, on my desktop. So we're going to go to the app and open the image. So let, I, let me open the image now. So I already have it open. And I'm going to open my image that I want to change the DPI. So I'm going to file, open. Let me just locate that file on my desktop. Let's see. Can't open the image. Let's see what it is. There it is. Okay. Okay, so here's my image. I could just move this this box to the side. Okay, so first of all, we could use this image to see exactly what is the DPI of this image right now. So if I go into image and I go into scale image, we can see right away the resolution is 72 um, axis by 72 72 by 72 okay okay so in this area here you would see the x resolution and the y resolution this is basically the um, information dark P dpi information um, before i go any further dpi means dot per inch okay and basically um the lower let's say you have to print an image the lower the dpi of the image the quality of the print wouldn't be that good so um, basically, if you want to like um, uh, upload a document to, let's say, create space, for instance, and you would like to have the document, the book printed, right? If the, if the um, DPI is quite low, when you print the book with the images, the images wouldn't look, it would look a bit blurry. So um, create space, for instance, like to have the images like with a DPI of 300 and more, okay? So you're going to change DPI um, like with the X resolution, the Y resolution, by just basically changing like 72. I'm putting, let's say, 300, and I'll change the Y resolution, okay, and then we click on scale, and that's it, so let's go to, go back into image, and go back into scale, and we, well, of course, we'll see it has been saved, all right? Okay, folks, it's that simple. So this is how you change the DPI of your image using GIMP. All right. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.